Vidal readies himself for a new camp switch. Real Madrid have slapped a serious price tag on Luka Modric. Ronaldo wants Marcelo to join him at Juventus. And Spurs are willing to listen to offers for three of their star players. That and more coming up in the next few minutes. As I'm your host, Matt Froelich, you were the one footballers, and this is the Daily News. First up, and Barcelona have agreed personal terms with Bayern Munich midfielder Arturo Vidal ahead of a £27 million move to the Spanish Giants. The tough tackling midfielder literally went from yesterday morning training with Bayern to yesterday afternoon on the verge of a potential deal to Barcelona. However, when they're involved, you can kind of understand how swiftly you'd move. The 32-year-old Chilean is set to take half of the amount of wages that he would have got had he moved to Inter Milan. But at the end of the day, Barcelona is always going to be Barcelona. And sticking with Inter Milan, they may be missing out on yet again another transfer target in midfield as the price tag is just ridiculous. You know when you go to the store, you find a nice piece of clothing, you look at the price tag and think, damn, that's way too expensive. Well, imagine how Inter Milan feel. They looked at Luka Modric, see that he fits the bill, pick up the price tag and bam, Real Madrid said they wouldn't accept anything less than his release clause, which is around £670 million. Ridiculous. To be honest, I don't even want to talk about this. I don't even want to think about the fact that the transfer record could be more than tripled in just one move. Let's talk about this when there's something more concrete. Staying in Italy though, and just one week into training with his new club, Cristiano Ronaldo is already calling the shots in the transfer market. According to reports, Ronaldo wants his new team to go back to Real Madrid and bring his best friend Marcelo along with him to his new club. I'm not sure it's all too realistic at the moment. However, when your key star man says he wants something done, you usually bend over backwards to do it. So I can see Juventus trying to push this one through. The knock-on effect will also mean that Alexandro will probably leave the club with PSG and Manchester United circling. As for Manchester United signing new players, well, they'll be feeling a lot more positive about their chances given the recent news from Tottenham Hotspur. Spurs have said that three of their first team players are up for sale, including Manchester United targets Danny Rose and Toby Alderweireld. A deal for them both could cost over £100 million. However, that does allow Mourinho to tick off one more on his list of excuses as to why United are doing so poorly. As for the third player leaving Spurs, it could be Moussa Dembele with Napoli and again into Milan, both said to be interested. And finally, we have the rest of the day's transfer roundup, where Wilfred Zaha could be set for a move across London from Crystal Palace to Chelsea who have also rejected a bid for £31 million for their goalkeeper Thibaut Courtois from Real Madrid. Wolves are set to smash their transfer record by signing Middlesbrough winger Adama Traore and Everton face competition in signing Marcus Rojo from United with PSG, Marseille and Zenit St. Petersburg all interested in the Argentinian. So that's all from me for now. Make sure you smash that like button and let me know down below everything about the day's transfer rumours, the done deals, the ridiculous price tag and anything else you may have heard in the footballing transfer window. Until next time, I'll see you guys later.